How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Deadly Premonition. And we're kicking off with a loading screen, unfortunately. But that's because we immediately go into a cutscene, which I start re recording, and then there you go. This. The lumber mill is pretty far from here. If that's where she was killed, why would the killer go to all the trouble of carrying her all the way here? I don't know yet. My profiling instincts tell me one thing is for sure, though. The unsub's personality is totally different before and after the crime. The unsub killed her in a brutal, horrifying way, and then displays powerful adoration after she's dead. Something close to love. That could well be the key to all this. Mm -hmm. I will say this, though, George. Profiling is a risky business. Of course, if the unsub planted those stiletto footprints himself, well then... Everything I've just said falls apart. But there's no evidence that he left those stiletto footprints. I'm sure we have Miss Stiletto Heels to thank for those tracks. All I can do is deduce the unsub's feelings in light of the evidence. And carefully figure the unsub's M.O. Modus operandi. His way of thinking. It usually unveils something that a normal forensic analysis may overlook. That's my way of profiling. It's not for everyone, but it works for me. Okay. So we are driving to. Let me just turn around. You guys, all good? You guys, cozy? Okay, cool. So I got a, a bit of a long drive in front of me. It looks like a lot of driving in this game. But hopefully, we can get uh, some talking going on. So we're looking. I think it was. I don't, I don't think it was a movie star or something like that. But it was definitely a Latida person who's wearing so, those slow heels. I feel like. Not many when moving stars in here. Force, this lumber mill was still in full swing. It closed up right when I first moved here. And now it's totally abandoned. I presume so. I've never really been inside, so I don't know for sure, but it sure is run down. Deserted buildings are perfect for criminal hideouts and activities. I keep telling Harry to have the place torn down. Probably a little late for that. <laughs> After all, it's already been used as the site of Anna's murder. We don't know that for sure yet, Agent Morgan. But that's right, from your point of view. But the perpetrator selected the lumber mill. Agent York, you seem very confident about this. Confident? No. Confidence is a sweet spot between being rude and hopeless. I'm just drawing natural conclusions from the facts that we have seen. That sounds exactly like being full of confidence, at least to me. And to normal people with common sense. Common sense can be the opposite of facts sometimes. Bear that in mind. Oh, I will, Agent York. Oh, Thank I will, Agent York. Pearl of wisdom. Either way, we'll know for sure by simply going to the lumber mill. So keep your pearls of wisdom to yourself, and let's hurry. Um, well said, George. Can you step on it, Agent York? Let me. I just gotta consult the map for a second. <laughs> Trying to figure out the best way to get there quickly. Uh, we need to go here. Oh, can I zoom out? Yeah, I was. Oh, there you go. Oh, I can only zoom in. That's. Oh, that's fantastic. But it looks like I actually want to turn around. Gotcha. Okay. Or that. Okay. Really. And how do I... Oh, back. That's R. Yeah. So I gotta do a... 360. Oh, right. I got the boost, too. Which just basically turns that on. Also, apparently my car healed itself. Oh, never mind. Just doinked it. There we go. Back on track. So it looks like we just have to drive around this lake and bam, we're at the lumber mill. Which, I thought we were going to go talk to that lady about the silo heels, but okay. Uh, there's something over there. Who cares? That's a flower. I'm not really going to go, you know, picking flowers for any reason, I feel. Like I said before, there's a bunch of side missions in this th in this game. I'm probably not going to do them because I want to just focus on the main missions. Unless the side mission is like right in front of me and it's like, Hey, can you just shoot some zombies? And I'm like, yeah, sure, why not? This is a bit of a departure from what I normally wish to play, which... I don't know, what is that black speck there? I don't know what that... Okay, hi. Looks like I wasn't the only one who saw that. Oh, ow. I'm fine, everyone's cool. I do need to heal at some point too, it looks like. Looks like there's a race I can do too, which is, again, kind of weird. I am a FBI agent, and I'm oh, never mind. Oop, almost there. Just gonna drive through this barricade, no problem, right? Or oh, I can open. That's an idea too. 
Got it. Oh, or not. <laughs> I thought I was just gonna go like right through the fence. Wink. Thank God this car is like. Why does this car have full durability? It doesn't even care. I don't have to worry about gas either. What is going on? What happened in this game? Before it was like you need to monitor your hunger and your your uh, thirst and your sleep and your need to go to the bathroom and your everything. And now it's like, no, who cares? Your car's got infinite gas and doesn't take any damage. Who gives? Oosh. Check out another cutscene because there's I'm so many of them. Alone. You two stay here. I can't concentrate on profiling with other people around me. Now hold on a minute. We're investigating this case together. Listen, I can't risk the crime scene being compromised by you two. What are you saying? You're not the only professional law enforcement officer here, Agent Morgan. We know how to secure a crime scene. I'm sorry. That was rude of me. But this is how I operate. Furthermore... Yes? Furthermore what? To me, the outsider FBI agent, every citizen of this town is a suspect. You two could be in on this whole thing, for all I know. I have to keep suspects out of the crime scene. Ooh, How from can Mad you Shade. say such a thing? Is he making fun of us? We should have left him behind and come here by ourselves. You're right. I've never been so insulted. I'm sorry, but I'm just doing my job. Okay. I mean, I kind of get where he's coming from. Could have played that a little smoother, I feel, possibly. Maybe it's been like a that, different Zach? story. If they're pros, then we should let every first-person shooter gamer out there join the SWAT team. Haha, <laughs> got him. Uh, why is everything behind me all on fines? This isn't good. Zach, they're here. All right, cool. So we popped the gun out. I remember, though, we have infinite ammo, which, thank God. It wasn't for that. Now I can actually shoot stuff and feel a lot better about it. I do think I need to heal though. So let's check out our items. We have a small health kit. Let's go ahead and use that. Just a little bit. But, you know, actually we got an extra one. Let's go ahead. Almost full. If we swing our sword out, we'll fire a laser beam. Get him, get him. Got that dude, he's got bipped. Oh, oh no, I didn't, oh, I didn't see you behind me. Oh, actually to my left. No, let me just, let me just back up a little bit, or, or not, okay, that's cool. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna go over here. We're gonna handle this, like, professionals. Oh, wait, what? Where'd you come from? Ow! That freaking hit me with a crowbar. Alright, whew, that was close. A little too close for comfort, in my opinion. Get him. It, was that... Amazing. He said bullseye, and I was like, oh, cool, I got the kill? No. I got a steel pipe, which is a melee weapon, which actually functions a lot better sometimes. I, I hate using the knife. No, we're not using, the, we're not using that. It sounded like there was something also squishy around me. Can I, can I break this? Do we want to break it? Is actually a really good question. So I was hoping there'd be something in there. Guess not. Uh, this doesn't look like there's anything really hidden in here. Nope, nothing hidden here. Oh no. Okay, that works. <laughs> Just panic swung. <laughs> All right, one more, two more dudes. Bop and skaboosh. All the dudes are skabooshed. Did I say? Did, what did it say? Oh, I thought you said pick up item. I thought I said pick up pipe. Okay, so with, with unequipped, you can't. Is is this the most bulletproof box? No, we're good. <gasps> Ooh, health pack. Thank you. Okay. First aid kit small. A little bandage. Go ahead and reload. We got a chance. And make a run for it. Or not. I just what? Oh, okay. Just 
A little too close to there, it seems. Why is it going choo choo? Okay, got the Agent Honor. That's good. Uh, I'm sorry, is that... Is that the dude in red? Yes, it is. <gasps> Get him. Let's shoulder that door open. Where'd he go? That was cool, the way that they slowly unveiled him. Still don't know if he's a figment of our imagination. Attack. This is where Anna was killed. Or if he is real, though. He only shows up when those dudes are, when all the zombie guys are running. Now that's contaminating the crime scene. Start profiling. Let's see. I hear giggling. You're moaning. Okay. Seems like something happened that Anna wasn't expecting. I think Anna was expecting just to do it in that area. Now it's... And then she died. Very static. -y. It's also very long. I feel like it's taking a bit too long. Perhaps. And she's dead. Too much noise. We're still missing a vital piece of the puzzle. We just walked into the room, dude. There was like an altar thing there, some curtains that looked like they were tied up around, like some kind of dagger shape almost. I mean, I don't even know what kind of room this is actually. I thought this was a lumber mill and there's a stage it looks like almost. So we've got a 10 millimeter machine gun. Yeah, we'll grab that. Don't worry, don't you worry about that. I'll keep hold of that. I will happily hold on to that. Okay, so I thought that was a dagger, but it's actually something else. It's like all the curtains just tied together, it seems. Zach, it's almost like an altar. Was the murder some kind of ritual? Almost like I said that. Weird. Hmm? Anyway. Let's see what we got right here. Something in here. I'm gonna itchy all of a sudden. I'm trapped in this room. He just turns around like, hmm, that's interesting. Also, this phone is ringing. I mean, this place is abandoned and has been for quite some time, we've heard. A lollipop. Grab that. What was that on the right-hand side? Was that a razor? Oh, I can shave. Nothing says, let's shave, like being in some kind of crime scene thing. Change outfits. I can change item. I can swap out items. Uh, I can sleep? Is this? Yeah, that's a sleep symbol. Something in here, maybe? Nothing. Smoked salmon. Gonna be honest, probably don't eat smoked salmon that's found in a locker like that, but okay. We'll, we'll go with that. Uh, pick up the phone. Let's see what's going on. I'm not really hiding, I'm just in a room. There's a lot, there's actually a window right in front of me. And if you want to check it out, you could, oh, there's the inverted, the upside down. Okay. You got reverse peace sign, which is one of four clues we're looking for. Um, I'm not really hiding. I'm just in a room with, uh, why do I do this? I could just wait. Oh, she was up for some freaky stuff. Got it. That actually makes a lot of sense with the sounds we were hearing. So then... It does seem like it's some kind of cult thing. With the upside down peace symbol. It's usually inverted symbols are typically meant to imply the opposite, so... Like war, or dare I say, anti-peace? Is that a thing? Is anti-peace a thing? I feel like there might be something out of the center in this game at some point, perhaps. We'll see. 
Okay, there's her weird horse teeth. Because the like her gums were like massive. Anyway, so we've got a lollipop. Wait, I thought I grabbed the lollipop. Can I grab multiple lollipops? Oh, no, just the one. Okay. I can. Why are there so many lollipops? I mean, I'll take I'll take as many lollipops as this game's willing to give. All about lollipops here. Or not. Hang on, just, just grab... Was it three or four? Something like that. And then we're going to save. So I think that once I pull that... Once I go over here, hit this red thing. This... Keys to the engineering section. Let's grab it. I got keys to the engineering section. Why did the vines show up in the first place? A lot of this game is seriously, like, serious, seriously, seriously, wow. Seriously, like, we're gonna trap you until you figure out this very simple, simple, simple thing. My sleep is good, my, my, um, other stuff is all good. Uh, a little bit of hunger, you know, let's, let's go ahead and munch on that. Uh, let's take a first aid kit small. And we'll pop out of that. So, we will go check out the engineering room. Oh, okay, zombies are out. I see you. I see you walking down there. Buddy. Aha! To the dome. Come on, there you go. Reload. This guy over there. Oh, you're, you're dead. See, I'm just waiting for you to die. It's right. That breaking sound is when. Uh, come on, dude, out of the way. All right, whatever. You know, from up here we can try to shoot the, the other dude. Wasn't there one down here as well? Oh, I guess not. Okay. There's some honor, or not? Okay, I was gonna say there's honor down there. That I can't pick up. Okay. Well, we got the engineering room key. I'm guessing that door would be over here. Amazing. Um, amazing. Like, amazing. Stop saying amazing. You're talking to yourself about yourself, dude. Technically, okay. Technically, you could be talking to Zack about yourself. Amazing. Amazing. I'm wasting so much ammo, but it doesn't even matter. Just got that sweet, sweet infinite. Uh, engineering room. Over here? No. Maybe down here? Give me some distance. I see you up here. I see you up there. Yes. Great. Got um. Ooh, what do you give me? A bar. Okay. You can't keep this item anymore. You should clean up your inventory. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, then we'll put it in the toolbox, I guess. I thought I actually did clean up my inventory because the fact that I had so much, I used like the small med kit and all that stuff. Anyway, steel pipe. Toolbox it. Is there anything in the inventory I can use that maybe, eh, you know, who cares? Oh, there's the engine room. Unlock it, open the door. Take a peek on in. Any red robed murderers afoot, perhaps? Is this, it looks like a generator or something. It's rusted all over, it won't budge without a good whacking. Any tools handy, Zach? Oh my god, are you kidding me? I don't have, oh, I have a steel pipe. I have just the one. Got it. Keep going. Ha! <laughs> take that. Also, I think I may have broke my steel pipe. Nope, I got one more whack out of it. So, I guess we're gonna run down this place and step in this nasty sewage water. Yep, yep, we are. And we're just gonna pop your head open. And it's gone. Still, better than having a, a, a basically a broken, useless weapon. Okay. A huge upside down piece mark's been drawn in the steam engine tank. Any idea what it means, Zach? I really do think that we're a Zach. Uh, that's not good. Some distance. Great. Yes. Take him. Take him. Amazing. Got her. Amazing. Got her. Oh my god, thank you. Uh, anything behind me? No. 
And they take forever to fall over, though. And I can't walk past them until they do. Come on. Just die. Please. It's a Zerve. What can I observe? Something might be hiding behind the machinery. And I'm not keen on finding out what. Okay, whatever. They're gone. Ooh, uh, I don't like that. What the heck is that? Okay, whatever. Who cares? Just keep going. Oh, it's so spindly. It's all, it's all, it's like oozing down. There's also a baby crying. Not a huge fan of the baby crying sound. Oh, no, I don't like you bending over like that. Got him. Two shots. Every time. So good, I know. All right, we'll check out where he's coming. he came from. Let's see reload. Was this Max Payne? Baby crying? Where is that baby at? There's nothing in here. Why? Oh, okay. Oh, wait, there's boxes. Ooh, boxes. Okay, well, okay, apparently do not insert your gun into a box and start firing. It doesn't do anything. I'm just kidding. This is going to take forever. But I have infinite ammo. And it will let me through this way so I can see what's back here. Kind of hoping it's an item of some sort. Also hoping it's not an enemy. What do we got here? Ooh, what do we have here? Another smoked salmon? Nope, it's a golf club. I'll take a golf club. I'll 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 swing for the 18th hole. Oh, it's in this can I open this up? No, can't open that up. Never mind. Should have thought about that. Should I have, Oh, I can't actually go around that. Is there something else in here? No. Alright, well, I got a golf club, which is sweet. It sounds like the baby might be in here. Maybe? Oh, there's a toilet. Oh, that's great. Yeah, let's go ahead and... Oh, oh, oh. God, that's... Ugh. That's just straight up nasty. Straight down nasty. I'm sorry, is he chasing me now? That's pretty cool that only the top of the axe sparks. And like they put an effect to do that. Nothing here of any interest to me. Okay, well, I guess we're not gonna care about that at all. Amazing. Get him in the face. Good. Now we can reload. Hopefully you skirt around him. Yep. Cool. I was gonna say there's definitely gonna be a dude right behind that door. Oh, any anytime. Hey, right in the back of the head. Great. Never again and never again. Gave us two shots to the back of the head and it's all dead now. Oh, I don't, why did my microphone stuck in my head? Well, aside from the fact that that is a line. I, there was definitely a red thing there. Like, should have been able to check out. We're also... Oh, crap. No, don't reload yet. <laughs> Let me take this guy out and... There you go. I mean, there's definitely going to be more guys, but... Oh, God. They take forever to die. Just fall over and evaporate so I can walk around you. Come on. Do it. Do it, you coward. There you go. Good. Almost. Almost. I mean, maybe I can start shooting this down. Oop, there you go. Give it the old reload. Good to go. Oh, I don't actually I didn't actually have to go this way. Can I climb over this? Yeah, <laughs> climb up. Of course. I feel like <laughs> Why? Why would you do that to me? Okay. Okay. Or ow. Okay, well, why would you do that to me? Okay. Uh, can I switch to the tire? The golf club? And it's just... Boink, boink. Done. Hey, look at that. I'm like some kind of wizard or something. What? Did you drop something? Oh, you dropped the bar. You can't keep the same anymore. You should clean up your inventory. Oh, God. Okay, well, I can heal up. If I heal up, that should let me... That should give me some space, I think. Actually, yeah, it doesn't even care about that. Can I not use those those ones below? I don't know. What is this? Okay, well, there's smoked salmon. That's cool. 
No, just eat the pickles. Who cares? And we can drink the coffee. Which will give us some of our sleepiness away. You drank your drink down in one. That's good. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's do a medium health kit. And that puts us up at max health. And now can you pick up the bar? Nope, can't pick that up. All right, cool. So I guess what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drop the golf club. Because it... I don't know, it's like halfway full. I don't want to waste it. No. I don't know. I don't know. Let's just find this baby. I mean, honestly, it makes no sense to waste a melee weapon on boxes when I just shoot it six times. We can reload. Ooh, what's in here? Why is this blue? Okay. Oh, I can look through the gap. Why did I want to do this? I don't know why I did that. Okay. I got an observation bonus. Whatever that means. Well, I know it's a bonus, like a score bonus. But just keep, just keep banging on those boxes. One day or another, we'll go through it. Did I not did I seriously get that bonus? There we go. So it looks like I'm gonna come down this way afterwards. So what I'm going to do is, I already know that once I go through here, it's going to be a cutscene and then probably something eventful. So I'm going to do that in the next episode. I hope you guys are all enjoying this series. If you are, let me know in the comments down below. I really do appreciate hearing back from you guys. Give me a thumbs up. I also love those. And make sure you're subscribed to get updates for the new content or go live while live streaming. And as always, have a great day. Remember to burn bright. I'll talk to you all later. Bye.